This is SAT Test 2 Non-Calculator. Question 12, College Board is asking you which of the following expresses f in terms of the other variables. We have what's called a literal equation, same as a formula as far as the math is concerned. To solve for f, first I'm going to cross multiply. The denominator is divided by n plus f, so I'm going to multiply both sides by n plus f giving me r times n plus f on the left equals f on the right because n plus f over n plus f is 1. So that's f times 1 is f. I need to get all the f's on the right and then get them by themselves so I'm going to distribute rn plus rf equals f and now I move the f term from the left to the right by subtracting rf from both sides. Again, I'm doing the same thing to both sides of my equation. That leaves me with just rn on the left equals f minus rf. Finally, all the f's are on the same side, and they're a common factor, so I can factor out f. I get f times 1 minus r on the right. I can check that by distributing. f times 1 is f. f times negative r is negative rf, so I did that correctly. And that's equal to rn on the left still. I want f by itself, so I'm going to divide both sides by 1 minus r. 1 minus r over 1 minus r is 1. Those cancel. So I'm left with just f on the right equals rn over 1 minus r. And I see that that matches choice B. Come back soon for my next SAT math video. With math, there's always more.